Hello, my name is Chris with Metroline Direct, and in today's video we're going to take a look at the IntelliTouch OHP 9000. In front of me, I have an IntelliTouch OHP 9000 IP. It is a dual zone network audio player that can handle both music on hold and business music over an amplified speaker system. Some of the features of the device is its dual zone allowing both simultaneous independent playback of on-hold audio and optional overhead business music. It has cloud management where you can manage schedule and change audio content from any web browser. It, you can manage single or multiple players online through your account. Three ways to update content. LAN connection, Wi-Fi or USB flash drive. It has a built-in monitor speaker. It is wall mountable. It auto starts after a power outage and there's a $50 manufacturer rebate from CloudStream with any paid subscription. Some of the features of music on hold is it's ready to go right out of the box, preloaded with hours of music and thank you for holding messages. There's free access to www.cloudstream.com website to manage schedule and change on hold music and messages and there's optional premium content available as well. There's free personalized professional voice thanks for holding messages provided automatically when the product is registered. As for the overhead business music features, it streams business music from www.cloudstream.com, has access to over 70 commercial free music channels all featuring top name and popular music artists, fail safe streaming technology continues to stream music for 24 hours even after a network interruption. Music channels are fully licensed for playback in a business or public areas and are cleaned of offensive content. Storecast capability, insert customized commercials to selected music streams. And it's capable of simple or advanced scheduling as well. On the front of the audio player you can see some LED lights and you can see a USB interface, a micro SD interface, and a slide switch that says monitor speaker. The leftmost LED is the link light that indicates that you're connected to a network. The center LED is the power light that indicates that you have power. And the right light is the hotspot light that indicates that you're transferring files via the hotspot. The USB interface is used to add or change the files on zone 1. And the micro SD is used to expand the memory for zone 1. The monitor speaker switch, it can let you set it to zone 1 or zone 2 and you can hear from the internal speaker what's going on, what's going to be played with zone 1 and zone 2. On the back of the audio player, you have some connections that you can use. The leftmost connection is an HDMI connection that lets you connect a monitor and change the internal storage. The next knob is the volume for zone 1. The white stereo jack is to connect to a phone system. The switch next to it is 8 or 600 ohm resistance that may be needed for certain phone systems. Then the red stereo jack is to connect to zone 2 which is the background music. And then you see a network link to be able to connect to the network or to the internet which is re recommended and is required for certain features and then the far most right spot is for the power adapter. That's it for my video today. If you enjoyed my video please hit the like button highlighted here and if you'd like to see future videos as they are added please hit the subscribe button highlighted here.